Hello everybody, in this video I'm going to show you how to add your Strava runs to your website. So I'll use the widget that comes with Strava and you can display all your runs or a set of runs on your website. So I'm going to show you how to do that. Firstly, let me show you how it looks like. So on my website, on the sidebar, there's a section where it shows you my Strava runs. So it shows you the last five runs, and there's a link where you can see all my activities. So this is a widget that you can embed on your website using some code that Strava can provide you. I'm going to show you how to get that code. So if you log into your Strava account, I think it's best to do it on the web-based version. That way you can get the code. So once you're logged in and you go to your, your dashboard, click on My Profile. Then if you scroll down on the right-hand side, you see Share My Runs, where you can embed a Strava widget on your blog. So click on that. And there's two options that you can embed on your website. The first one is the activity widget, which is the one that I use that displays your latest runs. So I want to display the last five runs. And then you also have the summary widget, where it just displays the stats for the current week. So I prefer to display all my runs rather than just the, the stats for the current week. So you have the option to do both. All you need to do is copy this, which is just an iframe copy that go to your blog I'll use WordPress log into your dashboard go to appearance and widgets so I put it on my sidebar widget area just need to add a custom HTML just drag it and drop it here give it a title, so I gave it my Strava runs, and then just embed or paste the code that you copied from the Strava. Just hit save, and that's it. Just make sure you delete the cache if you've got any cache, and then just go to the website. Refresh the page and it should be there. So that's how I display my Strava runs. You can embed the Strava runs on a page or a post as well. So all you have to do is just add it as a HTML code. And make sure you just save it. Refresh the page. And then it will display. So that's how you display your Strava runs on your website or blog. If this helped you in any way, give it a like and subscribe to the channel.